Okay. <laughs> Can you hear me? <laughs> what? You guys, what happened? Uh oh, hold on. Is it Staty King? I'm watching the, the audio read. So, I don't know what the problem was. I went ahead and, and I opened up like a... Uh, like an Audacity file. Like an Audacity recording. And... Um, and I just like... Ch just kept changing my mic settings and it just started going away. So, I don't know. Maybe I'll just use this as an excuse to buy a new mic. <laughs> We have another one of these... Okay, we need to get back on track. We have another one of these space doors. I don't want to edit the end of the last stream now. I'd like to upload that to YouTube. I don't want to edit it. Yo, where, Will, where did you get this gray emote? That's a good emote. I like that. The grays, yeah, the gray. What if it was an ARG? Like, what if this was the launch of, like, an alternate... Like, like this was the launch of, like, me fucking, like... You know, like what? Like I like started it like a like a game right now. Like there was a plot to this, and you had to find out where I went. That was gonna be my backup if this if I couldn't get the mic working. I was gonna make it up on the fly. All right, and so now I'm gonna go ahead and just trek back to the other space door, just because I'm paranoid and I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Why not? This wasn't too far back, right? How's it going, Andrew David? You just missed uh, the void we went into for a little bit, but it was, it's been going pretty okay, other than the void. Other than the void, you might just want to try the green doors. Yeah, I, I am going to try them. I'm going to try this one back here. <laughs> Hopefully they'll eventually like meet at a point. They'll loop around or something. How did I get to that green door, by the way? Whoops, I forgot. But to be fair, we had a mini crisis we had to avoid. Was it up here or something? No, not you. I don't like it. Do, 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 gee, do. Do, do, do. Have to catch the replay? I mean, if you want to hurt your ears. Okay, so it wasn't over here? <laughs> I thought I went through the middle door. I guess the... <laughs> Wait, the middle had the green? <laughs> what is this snack after dark stream? This is the new uh, schedule. The Springliachi crevice. The Springliachi code. Yeah, here we go. This is what I was looking for. What's up, K-Man? Shouts to K-Man. K-Man though is the most chaotic force on Fall Guys. Oh, here we go. Oh, it's a little Bobbleton. Ooh, a customer. Rare. Look, why not take a load off? Moving is tiring. Yeah, they're adding killer to PW4. Whew. That's crazy. Sprungliachi's trick. This is his face dandy character. It does look like it. I'm gonna turn the mic down actually a little bit. It looks a little bit loud on the readout. Yeah, I was actually going to say that. I might have been trying to say that as soon as I went into death mode just a little bit ago. Or I was going to be, um, I was going to say that earlier and I and I got, I lost track of what I was saying. But yeah, I, I woke up today and got ready for work and everything. And as I was logging in at like 2, I looked into, into Discord and call day was happening. <laughs> With like, uh, like Meech uh monkey foo and will maybe i don't know who else was in call day but like i couldn't believe it space byway Oog, haven't seen one haven't eaten one either yeah space is endless you gotta take your time baby and go with the flow all right what's what's in here Aha. Bo boinch oh shit <laughs> Sizz. Yeah, I mean, I could have, like, I guess I could have joined Call Day, too, but, like, by the time I was, like, looking at Discord, I was almost time for me to work. 
Does this work till five? Or it didn't work until five. Imagine sleeping until five. Yeah, the K-Men was pretty good. It reminds me of when we all were Kyle at that one con. Before we even got to the con and the fellows were already, you know, getting shenanigans. I love that. You love those triple kills. Is this the ending of Paper Mario? No, this is like the halfway point, if that. This is chapter four out of eight, seven, I don't know. I'm gonna go ahead and call it. What, there's seven hearts, right? I think there's an eighth chapter though. Or one of the chapters I feel like is not even like really a chapter, I don't know. Don't remember, end of Sprungliachian. Yeah, that's what it is. Cause we are exterminating the Sprungliachi race. This is where they came from, by the way. They came from outer space. They sprunged down here from outer space. Them and the Boom Boxman. Nah, you you're you're here. This is I mean this is definitely a, like a feature length game for sure. What was the game that? All right, here's a question of the day. What's the game that you played, and you were the most disappointed by the length? <laughs> I feel like that's a good question, right? I remember playing Lost Winds on uh, on the WiiWare and just starting to get into it, just being like, oh, this is kind of cool. Like, I'm, I'm kind of into the, like, kind of puzzle mechanics and the art style of this, and then it was just over. Lost Winds is like an hour-long game. <laughs> I think they did more episodes of it or something, but I didn't know that. I thought it was going to be, like, a full game, and it wasn't. <laughs> Greetings, young explorer. Yeah, there were more, there were other lost wins past the first one, but I only played the first one, and it was like right when it came out. So I didn't know. I thought it was gonna be like a real like platformer, or like, you know, like kind of puzzle platforming former game like that. Greetings, young explorer. Welcome to this remote land. You must be bushed, Bloog. Look at this old guy alien. Blappy, and I'm 72. They have Earth years here? Okay. What if he's like 72, but the years here are like a thousand Earth years? Was pretty surprised first time I played Undertale. I actually felt Undertale was just as long as I thought it would be. I think there's another good one for me, but I'm trying to remember what it is. This guy's like a plumbus. Look at his little plumbus hole. A clue in the space ruins. A thousand coins. Too rich for my blood. What a weird thing for Mario to say. It's like he just talks out of a little asshole in his belly. Too expensive. Maybe a little bloog. <laughs> now he's just coughing up bullshit on us. Got a touch of lard lung. All right, I'll buy it for 100 coins. The ancient clue. Joker's clue. The scroll has the following words scribbled on it. By Rockman's noggin, when outer space is reversed, the door secret hides. Go home. Come on, guy. We're friends now. We're friends, right? Disappointed by how long birthright is. I think the one I was disappointed with was Hob. <laughs> this has got to be like, a, you know, like an acronym for something, right? But what is Hob? <laughs> Heart of Barkness. Ending didn't feel like a good ending. The game was fun, and it was the first indie game I ever defeated. It's called Hob. Okay. I never heard of that game. But wouldn't it be cool if there was a name called Heart of Barkness? We're friends now, smile.
I know Calvin and Hobbs. You know the feeling of like when you're really into a game and you don't want it to end? I don't feel that that much anymore. But I used to feel that way all the time. Because now I'm like, I just, I, right now I sort of feel like very, very comfortable with like the level of, ex of length that most games are. I used to get a lot more attached to things in that kind of way. But not that it doesn't happen. I feel like I maybe played a game like that. I kind of didn't want Dragon Quest XI to end. Um, I mean, I, I did the whole post game for that game. Like, and by that I mean I like really did the whole post game. So, uh, you know, that that was like I, after that I was like I feel that this is enough. <laughs> but in the story, like when I was really in it there, you know. It's sort of like like a game that you really like winding down is the same feeling as like being told you have to go home at a friend's house like in an hour, you know? Like when you have to leave but it's but you haven't left just yet and you're like you're finally like you're in that like twilight era where like it doesn't matter what you do because you only have but so much time left to have fun, you know? <laughs> All right, did we go in here? Did we do this? I didn't even talk to this one. I walked right past this door. Yeah, it's a Sunday afternoon for sure. Aren't you fancy? Let me guess, you're hunting the treasure too, right? I'm looking for toilet paper. Go look for the elder. Oh, okay. So, we're getting everything in here. Yeah, I was just thinking about using one of my heels. We didn't even need it. Used to feel that way about FF9 when I was younger and never wanted to go past disc 2, but finally defeated it last year. Hell yeah. The thing that I think is weird about RPGs too, is so many of them have like, so many of them do like a, like, <laughs> right before they go into the final act, which in a lot of RPGs is like a pretty long thing anyway, but like right before they go into the final act, almost all of them have you go do some bullshit. Do you ever notice that? Like, um, like they like, <laughs> like if you if there's an RPG with like an overworld, Final Fantasy does this. Um, even Dragon Quest kind of did this. A lot of the time there will be like five hours of you just like flying from place to place like doing a thing, maybe not five hours, but like an hour or two. And then it's just like, it ends after that. Like now you can go in <laughs> to like the final area. I just feel like that's such a weird, like that doesn't help the feeling at all. You're like, well maybe there's more left. And then there's like two hours left and now you're in the finale. What did, what does the clue say again? Okay. By Rockman's noggin, when outer space is reversed, the door secret hides. Okay. I assumed this meant outer space reversing. Because this is Rockman's noggin. We would think it, it has to do with this thing, right? Do I need a pixel for this, maybe? <laughs> Might cry when we have to say goodbye to Scoobcast. It's not like, you don't need to like hide here with Slim or something dumb, do you? All right, well, this wasn't a very cool secret. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Do we have anything else? Maybe the ancient clue is the toilet paper. Whee! 
Worth a shot. So a key here? Yeah, maybe the maybe the treasure is the key, and, uh, and I don't know. And the toilet paper is the, is old man's hint. Just wanted to see if there was something up there. Yes, okay. We're so smart. Fleep has awaited you. At last we meet mi amore. Ah, my sweet, a sweet, a peperucci. Now we do part, amore. For you, down you, down you depart. Oh no. Oh, okay. It was a pixel in there. You're so freaking cool. It's a paper miracle. A fleep is a feeling good. That we were this we were made for this pixel. <laughs> you bring a fleep to happy. Fleep has been awaiting for so long, amore. See si, for this momento. We pixels are helpful tools, see, but we know choose masters, be they good or bad. Leap has the passion. We love this. Yay! The reversible pixel named Fleep. Use him and you can turn over sections of the screen. Oh, I don't remember this power at all. On the back side of the sad is the happy. We'll find it. You and Fleep, amore. This is what we were doing, by the way. Okay. Oh, it just, like, flips a little thing. Can I flip the script and make it to the top ten? Can you? Did it flip the little sign? It didn't. I don't know where we're else we might need to use this at, but I'm gonna just guess nowhere. I don't know. <laughs> Can I flip the lock off? Do 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 chi do we? All right, we can know we can flip this. Flip this, and we saw one of these in another area too, right? Where was it? Do you guys remember? Because I sure ass don't. Where was it that we saw that? It was in like another level? I don't know if it was in Flipside. I don't think it, maybe, it, you know, it is in Flipside. It's in that wall. That's where we, that's probably how you get to um, the next pillar. To place the next heart. All right, hell yeah, we're making progress now. Yo, the fuzzy tree. Yo, fuzzies came from space. Now we know. We know their darkest secret. What's this? A bag of ingredients? Oh yeah, cake mix. Put detergent in it. Is there anything? Is this better than anything? Let's just take it for fun. It's worse than that shroom shake, but why not? Maybe I'll need it for something. Snack should close out his stream with this. What is it? I'm looking. <laughs> Alright, well this is a video, so I'll play this and watch this later. Mario and friends, head to the Space Bypass in search of the Puahato. How did Squirps know about this secret route? Our hero stared suspiciously at him. Why are you staring like that, said Squirps? Are you falling for Squirps, Uwu? In the darkness of space, the eyes of Squirps gl glinted mischievously. Almost a gented. 
Doesn't sound good. The gates of space. We're gonna do a little gateway shuffle here. You guys like gateway shuffle? Episode three of Cowboy Bebop. This is the space bypass. We can, yeah, from somewhere in here, we can enter the Woe Zone. Yo, Woe Zone. Woe Zone. Come on, space grunt. Look for the entrance, squee orc. The Woe Zone? You simply must be kidding with me. I demand answers. It's a prohibited zone. The space graveyard. Holy shit. The Oh Zone. It's a complicated maze. Oh. <laughs> no. We don't want this. Look, that level where we were platforming around was fun. Can't we go back and do something like that again? Mm-hmm, you little imp. I'm hungry. I made it some room with a pit stop. Now I'm hungry. But don't worry about that, space grunt. Find the woe zone entrance, squibble. We need to find some grub, I think. Let's chow down. Yo, what is this? All right, I guess just a, an, an obstacle. Ouch. All right. Let's swim. Kill them all. Should I go to Taco Bell after this? Will they be open? I actually don't know. How late are they open? <laughs> I've been doing so good this week, actually. I've been eating well. What if I just ruined it all? Do 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 do. They're only open till two. Damn. Yeah, I feel like they should be open like all night, but they aren't, right? All right, I think we need to use Flippaducci here. Flippaducci. What was his name? I already forgot. It doesn't like, it feels like it doesn't have anything to do with what he does. What, what's his name again? Flip. That's, oh, I guess Flip, right? <laughs> so stupid. I'm so dumb. What's his name again? Like he flips things. Like, what, shouldn't it be like Flip or something? Flip. Squirrel squack. This hole, what a lovely shape. I want to get in it. This treasure log mission. That's pretty good. I need to play more Pirate Warriors. I don't want Sizz to catch up to me. I want to I want to be squeezed in here. This is Squirk's fetish. Someone squish me in. Yeah, I'll squish him. He's he's putting us through some stuff. Squeezerp. Yo, this is just fucking Junji Ito. <laughs> this is the this is Ami Amigara fault. <laughs> His soul was made for him. Oh, man. What if in the Japanese he said that? Do you think? What is this thing? It's a space gate, Squirp. They lead to the space bypass from the Woe Zone. I think they reprinted uh, Amigara Fault. I, was look I saw someone post about that on Twitter the other day. They just did a Junji Ito release. Which I think is just a short story, but I think they reprinted that story in the new release. <laughs> Yo, we did it. I didn't mean to do that. I was just trying to swim up. Boom, boom. Okay, I guess we just go. Ha, ha, ha. Another space gate? Oh, this is where we're entering the maze. That's what's happening. Oh, we need two fleeps for this. What will fulfill the strange alien's desire? Something sweet that starts with Cho and ends with late. <laughs> this will open the way. Lit? How would you how would you pronounce 
the L A T of chocolate. Cho and ends with lit. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> what is happening right now? I hate this. He's making a he's making like a weird champ face when he goes in there too. Squirps must eat something yummy. Oh, he's just going to stay? All right, I guess we need to find another Squirp. Yeah, this is pretty fucked. I don't know about it. I don't know what the implications are here. But we've lost our attack method now. Which means that I probably don't have to do a bunch of weird space bullshit, so that's fine. Just let the other thing be on this screen, smile. Is the bit that he's just like annoying and we have and he must be punished? I feel like that's sort of where what they're getting at. Which is pretty funny. <laughs> Yo, don't we need squirps for this though? Can I go back and get him? So maybe he wants chocolate? Is that what the sign is trying to tell me? Maybe he, when maybe if he eats chocolate he'll split into two. I have cake mix. <laughs> yeah. I have a fresh veggie. I ain't giving you that shit. I need it for my health. I need to ingest cake mix straight for my health. What if you were hurting? What if you were in pain and you just <laughs> chowed down on a bag of just cake mix? Oh no, there's already more shit over here. Why is this so vertically tall? It, does it loop around at least, maybe? No. <laughs> I don't know where I am. <laughs> Alright, well, we could get this catch card at least. Maybe that'll put me in a good mood. Yay. I'm gonna use it on this guy. Fuck the stopwatch, who cares? Talked about the impracticality of drinking syrup. Yeah, it's it would be so thick, right? Can I just try to use it on this guy, do we think? These guys have a lot of health, though. I don't want to risk it. I'm sure we'll get Squig back eventually. Why is this so much? Can't even hit that. Can I fuddly it? It's not what I wanted to do. Would you rather drink syrup or eat cake mix? Though. I feel like I might rather drink syrup. <laughs> like, <laughs> they just... I don't know. None of it would be great. I i mean, I'll, I'll eat honey if I have, like, a sore throat or something. Just in, it by the spoonful. And I used to just do it when I was a kid. Yeah, he really does, like, he grabs the handle of that jar and just chugs it down. Mario just gulps it. Alright, so these, maybe, hopefully these these blue warps are just, like, more for fun, maybe? Let's see. Test this theory. Is this, like, a whole ass area, or is this just, like, some stuff that I can get? Uh, I don't know. We don't have the data for this. I like this, though. It's kind of cool. Kind of a cool prospect. There's a save over here. Badlands Chugs. Will sent me a text an hour ago that just said smile. <laughs> Smile! Come back to your friends!
Yeah, we were talking about that the other night. Your homework of the day is go watch A to Z, the very a very mid One Piece ending. <laughs> Zebra likes it, I guess. <laughs> I'm unimpressed. Wee! Oh. Whoa, did you guys hear that weird sound? What was that accursed sound? Yeah, well. <laughs> Yo! Intergalactic Diner? Yo, are we going to boobies? Oh, it's like a gas station. Yo, this is where I'm headed after the stream. Because there will be nothing else open and I'm hungry. I'm gonna get some garbage and feel bad about my life. Yo, what what is this by the way? It is. It's like a little fucking 7-Eleven. Hey guy. Oh, have a twinkly day. Welcome to Twinkle Mart. If we're not closed, we're open. Wah! I was so lonely. Since our grand opening, you're our first customer. Yo, me and Comb are right. That's the moral of the story. I think I should have thought about location more when I bought this place. This guy opened a, a gas station in space. He opened a, a quick stop. What do you call these? Corner store? No. Mart? Quick Mart? Gas station? What do you what do you what's the name of the of the of the place where you can buy things in the gas station? Does it have a name? What you looking for today? Just grab whatever grabs your eye, Twinkle Shoppers. Oh <gasps> Yo. Should we get him the golden bar? Nuts and nougat? That's Nuts Island. Quick stop? But is it, isn't there a brand of it called Quick Stop? A shroom-flavored bar. <laughs> why, do, why, do these ga why does this game keep making me question these things? <laughs> Luxurious chocolate restores 25 HP. We're getting him a nougat. Oh. Alright, I'll eat some. I'll eat my veggie. We're gonna eat a vegetable and we're gonna go get squiggly uh, chocolate bar. I guess I could have ate the cake mix. It heals less, but whatever. Would you eat mushroom chocolate? Oh, the clerks work at Quick Stop? I think there is actually a store called Quick Stop, though, right? Is it real in the and also in the clerks universe? I wouldn't try it. I'm not a mushroom guy. I don't like mushrooms. I think they taste like dirt, kind of. I can't blast that. This is so fucked up. <gasps> how do I... How do I bop it? Bowser? No. I thought I could maybe breathe fire. Oh, look at Bowser in space, though. How do I get it? Maybe we just have to bring him back here. Maybe we have to bring Squiggly back here. <laughs> but you know, like, maybe for the meme I would try mushroom chocolate. <laughs> All I found on Google were drugs. Would you ever try those mushrooms? I would be sort of scared to. It's because I'm not enough of a drug user, you know? Like if I smoked all the time, I would probably. <laughs> I guess this is what they say, what they mean when they say gateway drug. <laughs> if I smoked all the time, I probably would, but. I'm, but I'm like, I don't I feel like I don't have the, the EXP. I think psychedelics seem cool, but like I know I would I would freak out. So like I've never tried them, but you know that would be it would be it would be I I would do it for for just out of scientific interest, you know? Yeah, like it's a morbid curiosity. 
Like, what it must be like. Because even, like, you know, like, the any, any of the drugs I've ever used, which is just, uh, like, drinking and having smoked some, which is, very, you know, very little comparative... It, like, you don't get, like, you you know how, like, <laughs> you know how, like, in the, in cartoons, you're like, we're on drugs, and, like, you're seeing things and stuff, like, regular, like, everyday use shit doesn't make that happen, but, so, like, to have that, like, real drug-ass drug experience would be, it's just, like, something that I've always thought was interesting, but would I do it? Probably not, I just, like, feel like it wouldn't be worth it. <laughs> Is Snack admitting to using drugs? I'll admit to anything. Squirps can't move. Remember how I admitted to to learning a Shakespeare sonnet to get girls last time? That's what the that's what the beauty of the late night session is. Yeah. Okay. Here, have a choco bar, buddy, buddy boy. Yeah, this is what you deserve. Squachomp. What if you give him a big squachomp? This is... Oh, he loves it. We did it, fellas. A full flavor with a clean finish. What does that mean? It's a sweet chocolate sonata written for lovers. It's pure cocoa love. Yay! Oh! <laughs> he became two, you guys. What if he said, Squatam, look, guys, look. <laughs> Sorry about that. Squirps got carried away. <laughs> yeah, all right. That's how that happened, I guess. The goal is nice, Google. Let's go, Space Grunts. So now we can shoot again. Do we want to, like, go back here and clean some of this shit up? I want to make things special for you guys that are willing to come out for for Friday night streams. <laughs> but revealing a bunch of heinous shit, I guess. That's how I do it. Sunday is the professional day. <laughs> Let that sink in also. Do you remember last Sunday when we were talking about Chiefy Queefy and the Mussy Nussy? <laughs> Sunday is the professional day. And Friday's the day where we just let it all hang out. This is Squib Kashi's child. Yeah, okay. I'm I'm I feel that. If you wonder what we're doing, oh how simple you must be. This is not where I meant to go. <laughs> if you wonder what we're doing, you clearly have never been around me ever before. Who knows? Who knows why we're going over here? Nor the Norky Nussie, yeah. Ow. Whoops. No! Can I go faster if I two? No. Yo, we revealed the, that ghost room. I was I was hiding over there. It must be up here then. That's what we came here for. The coins. And, okay, gamers, who knows why we came here for the coins? Because I'll let you know, you've never even been around me for one goddamn second in your life if you don't know why we went back here for the coins. Who thinks they have an idea why we came here to get the coins? The pulls! <laughs> Sizz is on it. Sizz knows. We came here to get the coins so we could do more pulls. <laughs> Alright, it was pretty obvious, but like, come on. We had to. Whale. Oh. We came here for whale content. 
I'm, I'm thinking there's probably a, one more of these doors and these little challenges to do. Let's see, he took a big shit and then he got hungry. What's next? Do we have to put him down, down for nappies? What if it was nap time for Squiggly? Yo, the Wii D-pad really hurts your thumb. <laughs> the Wii D-pad is not a comfortable piece of engineering. <laughs> it's fine. It's proficient for, like, short bursts of play. But, like, nothing more, really. I used to like it, too. I used to, like, think it was comfortable. I don't know. What was wrong with me? Yo, there wasn't another one. It was just for free. We did it. Yay. Alright, no more of this. No more levels like this. <laughs> I don't remember how this chapter ends. I don't know where we end up. <laughs> I feel like the pull for them to do to do like a shmup boss is too great for them to not do it. I feel like there's got to be a shmup boss at the end of this. Um, but we'll see where it goes. Mario and his friends took the space byway and merged into the woe zone. Holy shit. Known to some as the space graveyard, it was said to consume all. Oh, dead zone. Just a little bit longer. We'll be arriving soon, said young Squirps. With his unblinking eyes glimmering, Squirps continued to forge onward. Would Mario and his friends get their hands on the pure heart at long last? No. They went home instead. <gasps> you guys. The mysterious Mr. L. The mysterious Mr. Enter. Oh man, we're in the zone now. We're here, Squeagle. This is the woe zone. Squirps has finally arrived. Squoodly. Squirps is here! Squirps' is little uh, curled up tentacles on the edge <laughs> make him look like he's hitting the flex, kind of. <laughs> like, do we do we see it? Yo, listen to this music. Squirps can't wait. He's gonna scurry ahead. Follow Squirps when you can. But remember, Space Grunts, this place is a super complicated maze, unlike those easy mazes you were already in. You'll get lost before you know it, so pay attention where you're going. Okay. How do you know? Where is it? Just tell me, please? Yo, the thing, it looks like Evo in the back. Do you guys see it? Can't believe that creature left us at a time like this. But I must say, I do feel the presence of the pure heart. It's somewhere in this zone. This is this one right here looks like Evo. Yo, look at we're in data zone now. This reminds me of when in World of Goo when you go on the internet for a little bit or in like, you know, Kingdom Hearts. Remember the Tron level? Remember how they were like, yeah, Tron. It's like already a video game. Remember how Tron was like a good character though? He was like wholesome. People like him. <laughs> I feel like he's probably, he's maybe the most liked Disney character that's not Donald or Goofy. <laughs> or Mickey. <laughs> right? We found Digimon. Yo, I was watching the new Digimon, and I've like I've fallen off. I like have not been watching it. We're gonna just use our catch SP on this guy, I guess. We did some damage to him. I can probably get him right. He is lovable. He's just like he's just like a nice guy. I don't know. He feels like more of a character than any of the other ones like really get. All right, you know what? I'm gonna eat the cake mix. We did it. We stomached it down. Yo, well, I gotta know what's in here. I'm doing a dance to this music. If only you guys could see what it looks like. 
What if Mario in slow mo mode went? <laughs> what if he went? <laughs> yeah, that was worth it. Oh shit! Right, can I not go up here? Is this was this just for the stuff, or do I, can I peach over there? Can we use? Bridge. Huh. Yeah, we can. Alright, I feel like finding this was probably a good way. Oh. Ooh. Hello. Boop. This is like a Furby if you took off all the fur. <laughs> this is like if you... <laughs> If you boil the Furby down to just its, like, skull, that's what it would turn out as. Alright, so I think maybe now we need to go back. Yeah, he's, he's like, retching up, like, there's, like, dust flying out of his mouth as he, like, coughs out cake mix. But <laughs> he, like, keeps soldiering on. Yo, where are we right now? You can go behind door? That shit's crazy. I didn't know one could go behind door. This is kind of a cool level. I'm liking it so far. I like this pig union. Is it the, it's supposed to be like three blind pigs or what? The three little pigs? Whatever that shit's called. Three blind pigs, baby. Remember? One time at a carnival, I coughed up powdered funnel cake sugar on a girl. <laughs> That's funny. That's how I used to... <laughs> when I was in college, we would there was a dining hall where we would get pizza. And I used to just, bam, hitting it, hitting it, hitting it with the Parmesan cheese. I used to parm it up so hard that I would be going to eat my parmed up pizza. And my, my roommate who, like, we could just always make each other laugh with anything. My roommate would make me laugh every time I would be going to eat the slice of the Parmesan pizza, like like the cheese with the parm, the pizza with the parm on it, and I would just cough, laugh, parm all over the table. At first, he like got he would get mad when I would do it because I would it would usually be on him, but then he just started doing it to like be a bitch. <laughs> but it was it was funny. Yo, we're up here now. I'm a big Parmesan cheese fan, actually. I even like, you know, like, like, hard parm. I just like, sometimes I just eat it. <laughs> you can't get too tart with a cheese for me. You can't, there, you can't go far enough. The tangier, the better, I say. Yo, we're, we're going, we're going... We're going something mode right now. Yeah, I love cheese too. It might be my favorite, my number one. Other than bagels. Bagels and cheese. And you can put so many different kinds of cheese on a bagel, you guys. It's fucked up how, how well they pair. Yeah, we're gonna use a bitch again. Because of course we can get over here. Now, I, this is probably the, a new door that has a key in it, I would think. Oh, okay. Hello. We'll, we'll peach around for a little bit. Except we should probably... You just need to be Mario. I kind of wish the other characters could flip. I know it wouldn't leave Mario with, like, anything to do. But it doesn't really encourage playing as the other guys. Wait, is it this thing? Do I have to... What am I, what's going on here? Tippy? Got some authentic aged parm and made that last. Hell yeah. Oh, I can just go down here. Okay. I like funnel cake too. Kingo was talking about that. I think funnel cake is a tasty treat. Do we need to like flip back to that other room now? Can I peach oh, across this? Yes. Well, what's the point of this? Okay. 
piggies. Bling, 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 bling. Bling, 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 bling. Let's see. Let's drink a shroom shake. I think now's the time. Is there... Oh, okay. Didn't I go in here already, though? Or is this that other room? Where am I? <laughs> Me constantly this entire chapter. Alright, there's gotta be something good in here, right? Key? Yeah, okay. So now I see. So now we need to go all the way back, I think. Like, like quite a ways. I don't know where this door, this key goes. But I think I know, actually. I don't know where it goes, but like, I know. Come on. I'm having fun on this level, though. This is the only good one, really. All the rest of them suck from this chapter. Right, can I go... Well, I can't. we can't get back in the door if we're flipped, right? No. Can I, like, thudly this? You can, but it's nothing. How do I get down, then? Oh, no. Am I stuck? How do I get back? Oh, I see. This is what this is for. You need to use it to jump up here. Gotch. Understood. Are you guys controller drummers? I'm a big one. I just noticed myself doing it and I thought about it. Fucking... <laughs> what button do I push? <laughs> Okay, so it's, it should be down, right? Okay, it's down. All the time, yeah. Yo, look at this. Are we even in, are we even in Mario anymore? Show someone a screenshot and let them tell you that this is in Mario. Are we even in Mario anymore? Yeah, I'm thinking the key door has to be down here somewhere. Huge desk drummer at work. Yeah, that's real. Now that I'm, like, at home working, I kind of have taken to, like... Sometimes when I'm just bored, I'll just, like, do weird dances <laughs> at my desk. <laughs> While I'm just, like, being random and talking on the phone. It's just funny to think about, like, I'm like, oh, yeah, do you want a collision on the RV? And I'm just doing some stupid dance. Yo, we have 317 coins. We have so much money for pulls. Okay, sis, it means basically when you're holding the controller, you'll just kind of, like, drum your thumbs in the margin, you know? Or you'll even sometimes do it with the clicky sticks, like, with, like, if you can... Like, you know, if you can do L3, or you'll like just kind of like click around the control stick even. I do that shit all the time. Oh, okay. Now we have to tippy. Yo, is this it? Is this our arena? Oh. How'd you get in here? Did you wander in? Or did these guys come from the woe zone? Where they like bleed over from the woe zone? Whoa! I don't know if they should call it the woe zone, but more the yo zone. Like the whoa dude zone. I think that's what I would call it. Yeah, yo, we got the big health. Was there something else here? No. Alright, I guess we'll just go in this door. Oh no! Where was it, boys? Damn it. Maybe there's something in here? 
Hmm. Well, now I have to go, like, way back. Now I'll never remember how to get back here. There's got to be something in, like, one of these rooms. Like, in this room, I mean. That'll let us get through. This is my second favorite Paper Mario game. What's up, Lucario Brawl? Yo, we didn't go over here. What if it's over here? Or maybe this is just how you get back to the main zone. Oh, here we go. Alright. It wasn't that bad, boys. Crisis averted. We don't have to go, like, all the way back or some bullshit. <laughs> I would rank this at a very, very steady... I've only played three Paper Mario games, and this is my third favorite. <laughs> However, I do think I could probably still say it was my third favorite if I played the other new ones. Uh-oh. You think you can? Don't even, guy. Come on, guy. You don't even think you can do it? Huh. Got him with a big pound. Yo, why am I getting so much health right now? This is where the chest was, right? This one was easy mode. Compared to the other ones, cake. What if it was cake mix? Compared to the other ones, cake, literally. All right, let's do it, fellas. It's time. Do we have to fight Dementio? This seems like where you'd fight him, right? I guess I'll just go around. Or, oh no, you just have to hit it again. I think this I think it's got to be behind here, right? This is the save. This is the end. We did it. There's not a shmup boss. Maybe. I don't remember. <laughs> Slow pokes. How did you get through here? How did he get in? How how did he get through the keys? Did it did, did Squirps lock the doors behind him? The pure heart that you were looking for is ahead, Space Grunts. Oh, you've done well. Oh no, S the Squirps betrayal. No! Oh, whose voice was that? Squo? Oh. Ah! Squirp! What if what if he just killed him? <laughs> Who are you? Who could it be? Just one of Count Black's more promising minions, the Green Thunder. We hate this. Mr. L! Mr. L? He just he killed him. He just killed him. I don't need to I don't need you to tell me it's a cool name. I know it. Don't bother memorizing it. Why? Cuz I'm about to give you a burial at sea or a burial in space. Just because you're in red doesn't mean you're strong. Have at you. Luigi would never say have at you. But like Luigi's not here, so it's fine. Yo, he's going he he used ma on me. Mr. L said, Ma! See, that's, whoop, and that's, Ma! <laughs> what? No. He's utilizing Ma. Luigi is straight. <laughs> I don't know. He fucking died. Oof, impressive. Guess there's one thing to do, hmm? Come to me, Metal Bro! Yo. Do you like him? That's my dear metal brother. He and I share a spiritual bond, you know. Yes, and his name is Brobot! Jimmy Neutron. Jimmy Neutron. Jimmy Neutron. Jimmy Neutron. <laughs> Enough playing already. Now for pain. I feel like we were just talking about Brobot the other day. Did who who did someone know? Was it foreshadowing? Evil Luigi or is he just confused? Well, maybe this was his calling after all. Oh my god, is it going to be a real shmup boss? 
The gravitational laws of space allow robots' potential to be fully realized. Now Mr. Jumps all the time. We'll see who's the better jumper. Yep. I knew it. I'm so smart. I, di I literally didn't remember this. I mean, of course I remember Mr. L, but I, I like didn't have the confirm for sure that it was a shmup boss. I was just like, there's it's gotta be, right? There's no way it isn't. I actually don't remember the music at all here, so we'll listen to it for a little. I kinda can't hear it with all this noisy shit going on. This is pretty satisfying though. I like how many how like how much damage it like kinda like just like does like rapid fire. Yo. We got an option. Oh! Get fucking lit up, guy. Luigi could be a ghost. That's a good conspiracy. I mean, he goes into ghostly lairs all the time. He's scared of ghosts, but maybe he's scared of what he is. You beat Robot? They have Shiva? I'll let you off the hook for the rest of today, I suppose. But remember this, when Fortune smiles next, she'll smile right here on Mr. L. Whee! That was awful, Squirp. You died. We have to pull ourselves together, Space Grunts. The pure heart is ahead. Come on, Squinkles. I'm not, I'm not coming on now that you've said that. How can Hawkeye have a son if he's a ghost? Has a daughter. Mommy, 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 Squirps brought them here. Squirps, mommy. Oh. The queen of Squirpia. Her name is Squirpinia. The 14th? Oh, he was royalty all along. Milf alert. <laughs> My true name is Squirp Corogaline Squirpina. Oh. Sorry for not telling you. Squirp's promise not to tell. It makes him a target. Smile. Oh. Yo, he's from an ancient time. He is Space Momonosuke. <laughs> is this blind? Um, it's it's like gray. Uh, I did beat this game, but the fir the last time I beat it was in 2007 when it came out. So, not since then, and I've never watched a Let's Play or anything of it. I remembered. I do remember things about the plot and everything, but the the minor here and there stuff I really don't remember much of. I bestow upon you the pure heart in the hope that you will save the world. Take it, Squirp. Yo, blue heart this time. We love this. You guys like the blue hearts? Iconic Japanese punk band? Yo, look at Fleep over there being one of the gang. It's like gray, as in it does exist. Phew, now that Squirps is all relaxed, Squirps feels kind of tired. Oh no, is he gonna die? Oh. Oh, fellas. Bible thump. We need to do an 07 for, for Captain Squirps too. No! His tiny back, I grabbed onto it for so long. Bard sad. Just so many salutes today. <laughs> All right. Oh, we got this too. Yeah, huddle up guys. We're gonna have a quick new minion orientation. I think he 
died. Like, he, he fucking died, yeah. Oh no, he's here. <laughs> Had to leave to go home, Rack. That sounds promising. Favorite Paper Mario, Thousand Year Door? Of course. His name is Mar Mr. L, and he comes to us from one of our key competitors. This was all in- was the- did Lunch do the microphone? Was it all his doing? Lunch did it. But Lunch- maybe Lunch is in on the ARG with me. Can't say I'm impressed by the minion quality. No, indeed. No wonder you've been trounced up to now. You're like junior minions. Especially you, oh chunks. You fucking loser. Come here and I'll introduce you, fist, you to Fist Jr. and his wee pal Slappy. Oh, Mimi got a new costume. She kind of looks like Beach now. Didn't you get pretty spanked too? So maybe you're the junior. Oh, he was just, he was collecting data. <laughs> Only here to bring wholesome family values. It's true, I know. And that's what I fear most. So that's why I always cower. Definitely sat in a car and drank a Truly. There you. That's how you get. That's how you. You can. You can't get right to home wrecking. <laughs> right away. You, you, that's how you get up to that level. Yo, look at Mr. L's signature stance here. He's making an L with his hands. I need to hear. I need to re head to the repair bay for robot modifications. L later. Who was that guy? Though the man in red shall wield formidable powers, one shall stand against him. The man in green shall use the Chaos Heart's power to bring darkness to all. I can't believe this was in the prophecy. There's no way. Luigi was not in something called the Dark Prognosticus. It didn't have Luigi. It didn't have Luigi in it. There was no Luigi in something called the Dark Prognosticus. The man in green is our minion in training, Mr. L. Yo, my, my Wiimote rumbled when he just chunked it there. Makes as much sense as a beef and broccoli sandwich, would you, fellas? Calm yourselves, oh chunks. Make ready. Count Black is sending you on a new mission. Oh, we're getting a chunk match. That makes sense. It'll be me on her count. Chunks away! Where did Brobot come from? Yeah, I, I don't know. Did he make it? Mimi's just like, I didn't say anything. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Mimi's just not here for this one. No, no. Hate to see a whistleblower here. Or hate to seem like a whistleblower here, but oh, Chunks may not. Actually, even Dementio, Mimi, and Mr. L may not be up to this. That hero's gonna collect the pure hearts and come here. He'll come for you. Yoo-hoo! Oh, sad. It's strange, nobody ever, um, cherished the universe the way you once did. What? Yo, lore. Anastasia's getting so oo-woo about this. Hmm, what is- oh, intrigue. Yo, cold. How could he do this to our girl? We love Nastasia. It's always so foreboding with you guys. Sad. She didn't even go away. What are you thinking? There's no possible way. No one would allow it. If we can't be happy here, we must leave for a place that will accept our love. Like Arby's. But Blumiere, is there such a place? I think I can't think. I can't bear to see you hurt again. If our love has no home, let us spend our lives searching together. So I beg of you again, Timpani, marry me! I promise I'll make you happy. Just won't give up, will you? Of all the crazy, stubborn, foolish fools. Oh, 
Take me out to sea with you! What's the first video game you ever played in history of life, Snack? Hold on, we'll do we'll answer that question after this. Uh, can I say one number one, one piece free? Okay, we'll actually answer the question. Quite a collection indeed. What did I tell you, huh? I wasn't in the last chapter at all. You've got the king of all evilness on your side. You can't go wrong. But were we really gonna fight Mr. L with Bowser? No. He's not who he battles in the opening theme. That said, we owe Squirps for helping us find this one. We should be grateful. Squirps fucking died? Can we talk about it? Something seems different about you recently, Tippy. You seem a little more cheerful. It's a nice change, smile. Look at her with her hands clasped together. Look at the fellas actually all look great right now. Bowser's happy. Peach is being cute. Mario. You think so? Well, ever since you saved me from Fort Francis, I've been feeling really good. Yeah, she's doing a snack of ledge. I feel like I could just hang around with Mario forever. Oh, me? Oh, yes! <laughs> You're all back! Oh, Merlin. Hey, buddy. How was it this time, then? Did you find another pure heart in outer space? I think we found the fifth pure heart. <gasps> no! What happened? Oh no! Oh, Fujitora got big nerfed. Did they, take, did they take out his entire area clearing move? That's sad. That was the best move from Pirate Warriors 3. What's happening to Tippy? What has happened? All of you, come to my house at once. She's going to join Squirp. No! Let's all take a breather and gather ourselves here. I'm concerned. Tippy may be unable to maintain her pixel form for much longer. Probably should have told this us this to us maybe before, I don't know. Tippy was not always a pixel. I found her and I cursed her and turned her into one. She was hanging by a thread, barely alive, so I took a desperate measure. I transmuted a human body, Mario. That's what I did. Using my ancestor's magic, I transformed her soul into a pixel. I can hardly believe it. Where is Tippy originally from? She had lost her memory, so I have no idea who she is or where she's from. But I can't help but think she did not come here by chance. Fate connects us. Well, I don't know. Maybe once you power it up, it'll be strong, sis. Look at Bowser. Bowser's going crazy. The void has grown larger, and these tremors have become common fold, I'm afraid. The situation grows more dire by the moment. With even the, will the events written in the light Pognosticus really forestall the foretold doom? Yeah. We gotta keep going. We gotta keep pressing onward. Alright, but I wanna talk to Merlin again. All right, what was the first game we ever played? Hold on. Um, I feel like I, uh, <laughs> she's Pixel Rick. <laughs> Funniest shit I ever seen, Mario. Um, I mean, this is sort of a cop-out answer, but I have to say, I it, the first game I ever played has to be either Pac-Man or uh, M Ms. Pac-Man specifically, or Galaga. I know that nobody wants to hear that because it's so obvious, but like, I definitely played that in like an arcade or like a, you know, like a, like a pizza shop or something before ever playing any other kind of video game. So, easy mode, easy answer. Number one, One Piece. Another easy question is, what are your top five favorite manga? Um, so, and you know, number one is One Piece. Um, Shit, you know what I just remembered? We have to find the, uh, the thing for with... Oh, we brought... I already have Fleep out. We have to find the, the crack in the wall for Fleep. That's what we need to do. Did, you, did, this, did this guy just tell me how to jump? Come now. 
You must be serious. I don't think it's down here, though. I think we need to go further up. Maybe. Yo, I don't see uh, Sergeant Fish down there. Did he just die? Did he croak? How do you jump? What's the game where jumping is the hardest? Like, you don't even know how to jump. Don't even know my first video game? Probably Altered Beast on Master System. For me, it would have been a bunch of arcade games. Um, and then, I remember I played Super Mario World at a friend's house before I even had video games. And it is pretty funny that, like, I remember it being Mario World. Like, when I finally got around to playing Mario World, which was on the GBA, by the way, because I didn't, I didn't play that game until then. Uh, I was like, oh, this is that game I played when I was a kid. Oh, yeah, you're right, Sis. It is by the card shop. But, yeah, I just played it on a friend's SNES. And then I finally got Pokemon. That was the first game I, like, owned that I, like, really got to play as, like, my game. And it was history from there. Yo, we should go sleep at the Sleepy Time Inn. Is it down here? I think it was up there, actually. Yo, um, what was this again? There were, like, recipes or some shit? An ingredient. We shouldn't have eaten the cake mix. What about space food? What can you make out of this? Can you make me space ice cream? Choppy, bubbly, I didn't mean to skip that. I'm sorry. Oh no, wait. I made a mistake. Oh. Oh. Have we been poisoned? How come you can't turn space food into food food? Have we even been poisoned yet? The space dillas. What if she turned space food into space dillas? That would be so fucking blessed. Blessed be the day. Blessed be the Dillas. I want the Dillas right now. Yo. Yo! We can go out here. Oh! What is this? Where are we? Flip church? Mirror hall. Yo, church side. Yo, it's the four guardians here. Uh, Merluminia. That guy. <laughs> that guy and, uh, Merli. Maybe. <laughs> right? You know. It's the five weapons. Alright, what are we, what are these? What are we... Oh no, I'm so bad at these kind of puzzles, you guys. I'm never gonna pass this. Okay, it's the it's always the two right next to it, right? So we need to like I'm so bad at puzzles like this. I hate these kind of puzzles. Well, hold on. Can we just do it here? Wait. Or does it pass it along? Get ready for us. Get this is the rest of it. This is the rest of this, by the way. Whoa. <laughs> George Washington, Ben Franklin, Thomas Jefferson, and John Adams. I know. Yo, got the SNES package that came with DKC. That's pretty pog. How do I do it? It doesn't... I don't even know the pattern. What's happening? <laughs> do we flip? 
Second was probably either Yoshi's Island or Mario World. Those are the games. Does it go to the next one over? Does each one correspond with one other? Oh, okay, hold on, I think I see it now. Maybe. I don't know how to do this shit. We can probably solve it right now though, right? Wait, hold on. Damn it. What about you? No. Maybe black now? Yeah, that's what I was thinking it was gonna be like, but it isn't. I don't, I like, I can't tell what connects to what, honestly. Now left. Now right. Now help. <laughs> I thought that was going to be it. That turns yellow on. Blue turns yellow on. We could be here all day. Yeah, then a fish game. Yo, shoutouts to how we're going to get to see that on Sunday. What if you played the whole Spyro trilogy before I streamed Spyro 2? I mean, you would only have to play Spyro 2, right? Doochie doo, doochie doo. Because I know you were paying such good attention when we played Spyro 1, Will, that you'd know the whole game inside and out. If I was like, hey, Will, how do you do, how do, you do the trick on treetops? You'd be like, oh, I know. Shroom, shroom, shroom. You'd, you'd just do it like that. Catch a dream. That's gonna take that's gonna mean that we're gonna have Spyro year instead of Persona year. <laughs> Which is what we're currently in. <laughs> Meow bomb! I guess we're doing our pulls. I guess we're doing it. We're doing it, I guess. I'm get I'm, we pull till we get a rare. Oh, Moon Cleft. Hell yeah. What were we getting? We we're gonna get Francis, right? I think I have spiked Goomba already. Will can play a little the Spyro trilogy as a treat. Evangelion? Is that what we got here? Yo, was that a cool eel character? Patrol Meow. Yo, we're getting the whole Meow series. And they're gonna synergize so well with our Francis deck. Paratroop, I love that guy. Spiny, I like that guy. I think we have that one though. Oh, surprise! Oh! Yo, we're getting the whole Meow series out of the way. Right, I'm gonna just do it. I'm gonna pull another... I'll pull till we have 200 coins left. Putrid Piranha. You love that? He's in Smash. Shoutouts. Tyloid B. Ah, okay. Tyloid B sounds like something... <laughs> something you take when, like, after a... <laughs> 
after a long night. Just as a safety precaution. Slurp. We have like 10 of him. I know, we have a nice team, except we don't have the rare that ties the whole t deck together, which is Francis. You need Francis to make use of the mini cards. Oh, Choppa. Choppa. Ghoul Shroom. After a long night of shroom chocolate, yeah. Uh, yeah, I don't have my win con yet. Bullet Bill. Sort of a good fodder card. Blooper we have already. Alright, Francis. We're pulling him. This is it, Francis. <laughs> Alright, Francis. Pink Fuzzy! Purple Skitty? What if what if purple skitty card? Alright. Francis. Yeah, I reacted to it, Will. What or who do you simp for? <laughs> this is a loaded question. Rough Puff? What's that? Alright, ready? Francis. Wow. Or Boing Oing. Boingo Boingo. All right. Francis! Oh, head bonk, Goomba. Hell yeah. All right. That's all for now. Well, if I accidentally hit yes, we might as well do another Francis. Boom Boxer. All right. Boom Barrio. Okay, let's check our polls. Let's see, spiked Goomba we had, head bonk, did we look at this? We have this one, right? Yeah. We didn't look at Paratrooper yet. This Koopa Troopa breezed through flight school. Quick stomp to the head will ground it forever. Oh Jesus, it'll kill. We didn't have Spiny either. Do not want to step on this razor sharp baddie. Hoomst Barrio? <laughs> They're born covered in spiny spines. This makes hugging a spiny a little awkward. True. A hey, true. Did we have Koopa? I don't, I don't think we had Koopa Striker. I think we had Supa Striker. Oh no, we did have this one. Maybe this was the. Yeah, we, I think we had the both of those actually. We didn't have Boing Oing though. Oh, it's Sprungliachi! Yeah, okay, so this was worth it after all. I'm glad we got him. The bouncing bully splits in three when you stomp it. Stomp your heart out before you get swarmed. We love Sprungliachi here. It's a poisonous piranha plant. As they say, every rose has its venomous bite. Pink fuzzy. You had to, you, you know, yeah, actually. If you had to be a fuzzy, pink wouldn't be a bad color. Still, no one's winning any cuteness contests here. I think it's a nice shade of pink, at least. It's like a light pink. I'm a big fan of light pink, actually. I think it's underutilized. Anything else here? I don't think so. We didn't look at moon cleft yet. Yeah, too late. Or tyloid. Be, oh, these guys. At least we didn't get another Tyloid Y, though. It is not blue cotton candy. That's helpful. Bullet Bill. Do we look at you? No. Number one with the bullet. It does have a short fuse. Oh, this guy. Okay. It's a little thundercloud darkening a sky near you. Looks like a little cotton candy, but don't bite it. It's a cloud. It'll fucking kill you. All right, so we got the Meow Bomb. Patrol Bomb. 
This p <laughs> this patrol must in the hall is the hall monitor of Fort Francis. Ivor vigilant and flea resistant. Oh, nice. And the surprise meow. I like the energy of this one. The latest in feline firepower, a kitty cannon. Check out the visor they sport. Classy. Let's see what else we got. What's going on in the chat right now? I've been too much reading text. Tyloid Beodorant. Can't handle the summer at all. I like summer. We were talking about this last time. Oh yeah, we didn't look at Long Gator. <laughs> look at his face. Long Gator gets in your face. They have no respect for your personal space bubble. Yeah. And then we didn't look at any of these guys either. Yeah, they, they're, they're useful at parties. The space case. <laughs> I know, lately. By the way. If Taryn does a Dragon Ball rewatch, he's watching Super. I'm declaring it for him. If Taryn does a Dragon Ball rewatch, he also has to then go through Super at the end. I feel like I could convince him to do it. Eligon slither through the murky bits of the cosmos. Hit them fast and they'll shrink faster than their egos. What egos? Th you think this thing reads with an ego? Look at it. It's just squares. <laughs> oh yeah, Chapa. Oh no! <laughs> Check out this aerial alien's sweet mid-air tricks. Can appear and disappear in a flash. Not even fair. That thing came from the void. Megabyte? Oh, we, oh yeah, that was we had that one already, though. Oh, Ghoul Shroom was a rare. Okay, cool. I'm glad. We got something out of those pulls after all. What went wrong in that shroom's life? Fungus. All right. Do do do. I don't mind it. I'm I am ready for summer to be over. I'm ready for it to get cool again. Um, but you know, it's not so bad. When it starts to be like May or like June, I'm like I'm living. Finally, I'm like out in the sun, dancing around free. There's city pop playing in the background or something. We're bumping some Taiko Nuki or some shit. And I'm just living my life. Ouch. August is not, uh, August is not an ideal month. <laughs> August is suboptimal. Sub, uh, sub optimal. What were we doing? Do we, can we solve this now? Is there like, can we even do it? That's a funny conversation. Did I read that before? <laughs> um, maybe someone in here will like tell us the secret of the thing. Hello. Oh yeah, we need to keep coming back to Heronicus. I forgot. He's saying a different thing every time. Once a special agent who chased asteroids in a spaceship. But I tire of that. I do not wish to bore you. If it pleases you, come and visit me another time. What's going to be the end lore for Hieronicus? Is he, he's like the Luigi of this game. Luigi's in this game, by the way. Doochie doo, doochie doo. Are we done? <laughs> what am I do I don't I don't know where we need to go next. I'm, I'm assuming we need to use Fleep again, but where? I was going to rest. Let's go rest at the, at the inn. And if I don't know where to go, that means we're, uh... If I don't know where to go, that means we're, we should be done for the night. We'll find, figure out where to go next time. Do I need to buy any more items? I feel like we're actually pretty set. No, we're not. We need, we need items. <laughs> go buy another Shroom Shake from Shroombly over here or whatever. What happens if you buy this thing? That's not what I meant to do. You just get shop points, right? Yeah, why not? Let's buy it. It's 50 coins. I got that. Oh, six shop points. What does it do then? Hold on. 
worth a thousand points. Oh, it's just EXP, okay. For my score. It's a way to power level, I guess. I'll buy another Shroom Shake, why not? Why not? <laughs> yeah, what if at the end he said, there once was a man? What blue dude, Melvin? We talking Melvin? This guy? Melvin? Hey, what's up, Melvin? Alright, Melvin. It's fine. It's okay. We'll save the day. It's alright. Do 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 I didn't buy any catch cards, but whatever. It's more fun to do pulls anyway. Sometimes the levels just give them to you also. Yo, we've got a bitch of a level coming up next. The One of the few things I do remember about this game is that the puzzles on Chapter 5 are, <laughs> are not ideal. Chapter 5 takes a lot. It takes a man to get through, from what I remember. So that'll be fun to do next time. Everybody should definitely tune in. Did we go up there? What was up there again? We're getting to the rough patch. All right, I'll take your word for it. I think we're gonna call her for the night tonight, though. Oh, there's no way to quit. Oh, Bowser, does Bowser have more HP? Hold on. Oh, he has higher attack. That's interesting. Huh. Cool, all right. Bowser's strong. I guess it makes sense, but you know. Shoutouts to Snack streaming this so I just never have to play it. Yeah. I think it's fun though. Spoonie or we're not raiding Vine Sauce. Who gives a fuck? I'll raid Spoonie though. <laughs> um I'm too old for Vine Sauce, Will. I'm too much of a boomer. <laughs> I never got it. I, I did it. I've never known what Vine Sauce is, really. <laughs> but we will raid Spoonie though. What are we gonna say? What if we just did the salute? What what was the fish's name? Captain Gills? What was the name of the fish? Captain Gills with an 07. What if we did it? Unless someone has something better. Do 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 boo 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 boo. She might get the ref, but what? But was that his name, Captain Gills? <laughs> Captain Gills, sad champ. Bard Champ? What if Bard Champ? <laughs> I'll never be able to remember either. Maybe it's in the fishbowl? No. <laughs> we gotta. We have to go back. Susie, where are you? I also have to announce my sub renewal. Why do we always raid Spoony though, you guys? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. If I, maybe we won't raid anybody. <laughs> Will said. Will sent me a text that said, Hog. <laughs> We'll do it just this once, so Sizz can announce his raid. I'm gonna type in Mario Captain Gills. Captain... Oh, here he is, Super Mario Captain Gills. Yeah, okay. All right, it's Captain Gills. <laughs> this, is a, this is what the raid message is. Alrighty, y'all. Good stream, fun time, weird night. I was sort of had, I feel like sort of low energy. We played not that fun of a level, but it was all right. We, we you know, we had, we had a time like we always do. Um, thank you guys so much for coming out. Uh, we'll see you on Sunday for for more fun, for more Spyro fun with Nasty Nussy and the Mussy Bussy. All right, sorry the, the mic died. I don't know what happened. Maybe I'll just use this excuse to buy a new mic. But no, I won't because I'm lazy. All right, catch you later. Big love. Thanks for coming over. All the things that I normally say. Mm -hmm.
<laughs> we need to get our raid message ready. Or we need to get our raid started. What is it? Spoony? <laughs> How do we do it? E-E? Spoony? Like that? Okay, yeah. Alright. <laughs> Bye!